I gotta ask, what type of music do you listen to? Uh, everything. Uh, boy, I sneak and listen to them young killing niggas like a motherfucker. I ain't bullshit. <laughs> uh, I sneak and listen to them uh, to to tap into the to to the spirit of the youth. Uh, you know, so that's why you hear me speak on Pooh Shiesty, NBA Young Boy, uh, Lil Durk. Uh, not that I know they songs, but who who sang that song? For real? So I go listen to the most popular songs that the kids listen to and be saying, man, all these young niggas angry. Uh, uh, I'm an old school kind of nigga, homie. Them, 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 uh, uh, you know, them late 90s, that eight ball and MJG. Yeah, uh, you know, Scarface, Ghetto Boys, uh, T.I., uh, Young Jeezy, uh, you know, Jay-Z. So it's, it's, a, it's an array, homie. Uh, I'm a, I'm a product of hip hop music. Uh, I I separate. Uh, I cannot like the rapper and listen to their music. His music good. Fuck him. Yeah, nigga, yeah, that, I can I can listen to Freddie Jackson and they say he gay. Yeah. They say free. Yeah, I can listen to Luther Vandross and they say he was gay. You won't listen to Lil Nas X they say he was gay. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? So I can, but he ain't making no kind of music I want to listen to. It's a nigga right now rapping good in the motherfucker. The gay is a motherfucker. We just don't know it. You see what I'm saying? Oh. Uh, so what if you're rapping about the the crimp like an R. Kelly situation where people perceive the music differently now that allegations had came out? Can you separate the man from the music in a scenario where you feel like he's talking about the things that got you hating the man? Oh uh, no, nah, man, I can still listen to R. Kelly and, and not be affected by by him fucking them babies. We didn't stop listening to him. We saw him on tape fucking. <laughs> how we go? How we go? Quit him now? <laughs> yeah, nigga. Uh, uh, man, El Elvis Presley. Uh, Elvis Presley. Uh, man, I can name a, a, a whole slew of them. Uh, man, uh, nigga, Keith Sweat and freaked the baby on stage. Uh, uh, Bobby Brown and freaked the baby on stage. Uh, the 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 man is separate from the music, right? Uh, it's just like, say, um, we don't know how horrible them people be that make great music. We don't know what they like to their women. Uh, Jane Brown was a dirty motherfucker. Way done, Mr. Bird, nigga. Jane Brown was a dirty motherfucker. Way done, Mr. Bird, man. Selfish, mean motherfucker. They say when Jane Brown be sliding over there. Do that and get back over there to the microphone. They say Jane was fine in your motherfucking ass. You thought he was. <laughs> no, nah, he was hit at a hundred dollars, two hundred motherfucker. You done missed a step. But we thinking he jamming. No, nah, man. Oh man. man. No, nah, and he could fight. I'm so, watching show different now. So, oh uh, no, nah, man. Them people were some mean people. So, oh uh, no, nah, homie, some dirty niggas in the industry. Yeah. It's the reason why they go to. So we can still love their music. We ain't gotta like him. You can still love that actor in her, but we want to personalize everything. As black people, we want to, if we don't, it, we, we want to, we'll not like you for what you played in the movie, in real life. Yeah, that's facts, that is facts, no, that, yeah, that is facts. Yeah, in real life. Pick your role. And you'll never be able to live it down. Yeah, pick your roles, pick your roles. Because we want to, and everything's not personal. Yeah, yeah everything's not personal. Oh uh, yeah, so, uh, yeah. I know. How, I know how to separate them. Yeah. Shout out, real street stars, nigga. Moolah. Hey.